Well, if you're feeling it so much, how can we barely make love anymore? Yeah, um, I'm not gonna be able to make it in. Um, a late shipment came in. Tell me about your day. <sighs> I went and had drinks with an old friend. <sighs> we had a good time talking. Mm. <laughs> James already said he's not into me sleeping with other men. Girl, you like the taste of different things too. Just like that night after the party at school. Call me and I can get this Call me. He's still going. He was tripping on that one. I'm rolling. He's still rolling. Show him on the bus. Seriously. Yo, you had too much to drink. I had too much to drink and smoke and, and whatever else was floating around. That way. <laughs> yeah, you can't drive home like this. You're going to have to stay here tonight. Ooh, party. Yeah, girl. <laughs> I like that idea. <laughs> right, y'all about to watch me fuck these niggas up. <laughs> hey, baby, I'm hey. trying to call you. Hey, you? Hey, babe, what you been up to all day? Trying to get these junior transfers to pay for our school. This is Walter Bettis, and this is Jerome Smith. Hey, know. nice to meet you. I hope you choose to play for our school. I'm thinking about it. I'm thinking about it. Okay. Hi, I'm Tasha. <laughs> I love football. Especially when a player is a triple double. Triple double? She's tripping, bro. <laughs> yeah. Hey, but let me holler at you right quick. Come on. Yo, bro, what's up with that freak bitch out there? I'm trying to get some hair from that bitch. She don't know shit, shit about football. Shit, it's whatever you want to do. Shit, you bugging your girl ear. Got you, boy. Hey, babe, can I holler at you real quick? Alright? No, let me go get my little boy. He be messing up my flow when I hear him cry. That's not the only thing messing up your flow lately. What'd you say? Nothing. Wait. James. Huh? I'm 
ready to go back to work. Junior is one and a half, and I'm bored to death. Sometimes I just feel lonely. When a baby is all the company I have while you're at work, it's like I get tired of watching the Disney Channel. Shit, can I be around grown people sometimes too? Here, here I come. We agreed on three years old. Let's just stick to that. I mean, it ain't like we need the extra money or anything. And plus, with all this extra time, you better able to get that body back in shape like I like. Well, if you're feeling it so much, how can we barely make love anymore? Baby, running my own business is very stressful. I mean, just because I'm the boss don't mean I get to sit back with my feet kicked up all day the desk. I work 10 times harder than any of my employees. It might not be physical work, but it's mentally draining. Uh, I'm about to go to work and get this money. When I come back, we're going to go to dinner, OK? So yeah, we got the parts in. I'm gonna probably be able to move about 50,000 of these units. Um, how long will it take for them to arrive? Uh-huh. Okay. Hold on one second, let me put you on hold. Hey, babe. Hey, babe. I'm almost ready. What time should I get dressed for dinner tonight? Yeah. Um, I'm not going to be able to make it in. Um, a late shipment came in. Uh, we're going to have to do it another night. I'm sorry. Really? I wish you would have called and told me something. I mean, I'm going to make it up to you another night. Just kiss Junior on the forehead. And um, I'll see you when I get in. All right. Let me see what's going on on Facebook. I know that's not Keisha Johnson. Wow. I haven't seen her since school. Oh, I see her pictures. <laughs> Still the same old Keisha, wild as hell. Her life looks exciting. I bet she not in bed on Facebook by herself right now. Let me inbox her my number. Yeah, this is Tasha. Who's this? Hey, girl. <laughs> it's been a minute. How are you? Nothing, girl. Just sitting at the park with my baby boy. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's my first one. His name's James Jr. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I don't... I don't have any plans for the rest of the afternoon. Why not? All right, well, let me call my mom right quick and see if she can watch the baby. Is this your number? All right, I'm gonna call you right back. Okay. Keisha 
Hudson. <laughs> girl, it's been a minute. What you been up to? Just living the life, girlfriend. I traveled a lot. Dined at some of the finest restaurants. Tanned on the most beautiful beaches. Tasted the best wine they have to offer. Did I mention? I've tasted some of the finest men in the world, too. <laughs> of course you have. You should some things never change. I used to always keep things at school exciting, I can say the least. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I remember like all the dudes used to be sweating you. <laughs> what you was talking about? You was going with the professors. They was giving you money, letting you drive their cars. Oh my God. Them college dudes didn't stand a chance. <laughs> Except for that one. What? Justin. 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 The running back. Yep. Girl, whatever happened to him? We got married. What? Mm -hmm. He went to the NFL, but he blew his knee out the first game of preseason. That's too bad. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. That ain't no biggie. I mean, after he blew his knee out, he became so moody because his career was over. So he got divorced after like two years of marriage. But I still got half that signing bonus. No. Okay, yes, yeah, so I am good. <laughs> I'm good. At least you happy now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's what's up. I am. I am. Hey, uh. Do you remember that homecoming party at the end of your junior year? The one I got so yes. wasted. I had to take you back to my apartment because yes. you were too drunk to drive. <laughs> oh yes. my gosh. And when we got so, to So, to... are, are you seeing anyone right now? Okay. What's up, man? These two niggas wanna fuck Tasha. What? What you mean they wanna fuck her? What I said, these two big motherfuckers wanna fuck Tasha. Justin, she's drunk. That's my homegirl. I don't wanna put her in that situation. Look, I'm trying to go to the NFL. You do shit all the time when you drunk that you really want to do. I don't know. I don't know. Man, look, we trying to get these mems, you feel me? Millions of dollars, number one draft pick. These dudes can increase my rushing yards. We need to show them how we get down up here so they can sign. And other players that come too, we can have a little dynasty. Okay. Let me see what I can do. Get out of here, let me talk to her, okay? All right. Hey, Tasha, come here for a minute. Let me talk to you, girl. I still owe you one for that. And yeah, I have a friend. Actually, he's more than a friend. He's more like a, like a mentor to me. A mentor? In what way? Let's just say he teaches me the highest level of satisfaction in a physical, mental, and financial way. The highest level of satisfaction in a physical, mental, and financial way? I'm a drink to that. I like that. <laughs> so, um, how are things at home with your husband? Not so good lately. Mm. You know, it's like, I don't know. The business, baby, life. It's like, I'm getting the short end of the stick lately. You know, I, I used to always come first. And I don't know, now it's coming. Second or third. Well, uh, what type of business is he on? We. We, okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we own a parts packaging company for the big three. It sounds like you're doing good financially. You just need a boost in the mental, physical size of your relationship. Yeah, a physical and mental boost. Yeah. I'll drink to that. Yeah, <laughs> to a boost. <laughs> Girl, I need it. <laughs> mm. Boo. Girl, I'll try to keep it for I ain't mad at you. Right. Look, girl, this was really fun. We gotta do it again. I'll catch yeah. you in a couple days. Okay, All right, we'll love. catch up again. Tomorrow. All right, guys. Bye, Tasha. Bye. So, baby, how was you and the baby's day today? It was good today, actually. We spent most of the afternoon with my mom, and I wouldn't have drinks with an old friend from school. An old friend from school? Oh, okay. Well, that sounds fun. How was she? She. Tasha, don't start no shit. <laughs> I didn't know you cared. Tasha. Keisha Johnson. We started hanging a lot her senior year of college, but she like fell off the face of the earth when she graduated. Didn't keep in touch. The other day she Facebooked me and I unboxed her my number. <clears throat> okay, and what's she like nowadays? She's got her shit together. No kids, 
not married, travels a lot. No kids, not married. I don't sound like y'all got too much in common. <laughs> yeah, we never really did, but she always kept things exciting, you know? She's really fun. <sighs> well, I'd love to meet her. Uh, I gotta get some rest, baby. It's gonna be a long day at the warehouse tomorrow. It can be a long night, too. Mm, not tonight, baby. Okay, I'm tired. Okay. See if I can help you out with that. Why don't you lean back? Tell me about your day. Hey, Linda. Um, I'm gonna go home a little early today. I wanna go home and surprise the wife. Can you hold all my calls? Okay. All right. No, I just got back from the store. About to get my workout on. What you doing? Do you do yoga? <laughs> That's no problem at all. It'll be fun. Just be prepared to sweat. Okay. Nah, girl. The baby gonna be sleeping in five minutes and my husband works late. So it'll be just us. All right. I'm gonna text you my address. Power through those hips into a down dog. Here you go. Okay. I'll make sure the back of your feet try to reach for the ground. Oh okay? my god, I can really feel the stretch. Yeah, reach for it. I think I got it. Now you're gonna oh. breathe through. Breathe through it. Alright, you're doing good. Alright, so next we're gonna hit that side pose. You ready? Yeah. Alright, here we go. Excuse me, ladies. James, oh. so what are you doing home so early? I decided to come home and spend some time for, with you. I didn't know you was going to have They're company. They're beautiful. Mm -hmm. You're welcome. Thank so are you. you. Oh, this is my girl, Keisha, from the school I was telling you about. Oh, nice hey, to meet nice you. Nice to meet you. I heard a little bit about you. That's just all mine. I hope it was all good things, though. All right, I'm going to go put these in some water. I'll be right back. OK. <laughs> Do you like what you see? Excuse me? I said, do you like what you see? Thanks again for the flowers, babe. You're welcome. Let us finish this workout up, and then I'll cook you dinner, OK? No, 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 no. No need for that. I already talked to Mother. She's going to watch Junior tonight. We're going to go out and have dinner. Mm -hmm. Flowers and dinner. That's what's up. I hope you know I'm trying to be the man you need me to be. I know you see me grinding. That's for you too, not just for me. The patience, my dear. It'll be better in time. 
Not here to waste yours So throw me a lifeline I'm trying I'm trying I'm trying Damn girl, I'm trying Be with you than miss this magic moment With my radiant lady and balance this moment These fools don't know how to get a jazzy lady attention Trying to distort my vibe, she's smoking for him with her And the twine these messages, I'm so brilliant Trajecting these feel-good vibes, my lady, she feel it Rewarding me with sexual healing Hey mama I knew wasn't too much trouble for you last night, was he? <sighs> Mm-hmm. Okay, I'm a. Okay, yeah, yeah, I'm gonna come get him. I'm gonna come get him at one, okay? Okay, I, I'll see you then. I will see you then. Okay, I, I love you too. Okay. You wanna hit this? No, I haven't, <laughs> I haven't smoked since school. I'm good. I thought you was coming out to have a good time. It's not like your husband gonna know. My husband will smell that on me from a mile away. And I don't think he would approve. I don't think that he would approve. You sound like a damn kid. <laughs> you take Molly? What, ecstasy? Molly, girl, the good shit. I got some if you want some. Hell no. Girl, you really trying to get me in some trouble tonight. Hmm. I guess you don't party like you used to. You remember how I used to get. I try to leave that all in the past. I understand. Hey, this is Will's place. He's gonna set us up in VIP. You just take me to a strip club? Is this really a strip club? Girl, you're gonna have fun. Are Come you on. serious? Yes. This... You're gonna have fun. Get yeah. out. Come on. Trust me. Trust me. What the f? Five, ten, twenty, fifties, count it up, count it up. Blue face, hundreds, gotta count it up, count it up. When you make a sale, better count it up, count it up. Work on the scale, gotta count it up. Two bears on my ears, keep counting up. Five hundred on the number. I've never been inside a strip club before. There's a lot going on here. It's all good. Will runs a tight ship. It's no problem. Just a bunch of big booty strippers and some horny dudes. <laughs> I can see that. Pull your skirt down, you might expose your pill. When is he good? Chicken dinner meals. Hams get balled on, call him Lil Bill. The game fucked up, we can't work a deal. What's up, baby? Hey, Where y'all drinks at? I'm about to order. Well, this is Tasha, my homegirl from college. Tasha, this is Will. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, but I don't shake pretty girls' hands. Come on, give me a hug. <laughs> This is a nice place you have here. Thank you, thank you, thank you. It's a little something. Yo, Charlie! Bring them a bottle of rose! Them niggas take the stairs, not the escalator. Flex a one-on-one, I'm the demonstration. I preach truth, break bread with my congregation. She really wanna know a nigga network. Ask G's, cause I can't provide the answers. Big bank always take little bank. Hey y'all ladies enjoying that champagne? I'll come back and check on y'all in a minute. Thank you, baby. He seems like a really nice guy. Confident too. Confident or cocky? I can't tell which one he's most of. But whichever one it is, it's working for him. <laughs> All right, Tasha. Now this is to old friends and to keeping life sexy. <laughs> to keeping life sexy. <laughs>
Mm. Yeah. Where's the ladies' room in this place? Uh, down the stairs and to the left. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay. Salty like a cash baby girl with that tattoo. Look here, you working with a lot of ass. Hey, girl, it's like old time. I know, let's drink I'm up. Happy, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Good. yeah, that's good. <laughs> this is a nice couch. Right? It's like really nice. <laughs> Dude, it's so soft. It's cool. <laughs> I love this dress. Where'd you get it? It's so soft. Did you shave today? Your legs are so soft. Oh my god, you're so smooth. <laughs> Oh, I hate you lights can't bitches. You're so soft. Oh my god. <laughs> Your ass still can get wild. Oh right? my god. Act like you know. You try to play the good housewife role though. You really do. <laughs> I don't know what got into me. It was like all of a sudden I wanted to touch every booty in there. <laughs> I've never felt anything like that before. Yeah, she was having a good time. We had every dude in there looking at our food. Fuck it! <laughs> Fuck it, I had so much fun though. <laughs> You had fun tonight? Yeah, we had a good time. That's what's up. You weren't about to leave without giving me a kiss, was you? That's all you want? You want a little more? You know, I always want more with your sexy ass. Get your ass in the back then. Hey, baby. Hey, baby. What you bring me to eat? I brought... Me. Tasha, what the hell is you doing? I thought I would surprise you with some sex and sporadic for lunch. Baby, I got a meeting in 10 minutes. I can't, I can't do this right now. I thought it would be fun. Exciting. Look, I brought Patron. So, I supposed to go into my meeting drunk? I mean, come on, I can't do this right now. I thought you was bringing me something to eat. I don't think you was thinking at all, baby. I don't think you was thinking at all. I, I can't do this. Sorry.
So I went and got his ass some Wendy's to keep him from bitching. That's fucked up. He really need to get his shit together. Don't need no milk, sir. I ain't no damn milk. <laughs> you're a mommy. You're hot. So you're a mom I'd like to fuck, fuck you, Keisha. <laughs> <laughs> I know I'm still pretty, but I just, I want him to treat me like it, you know? I miss that fire. Like you and Will's relationship. Y'all got that fire. I miss that fire bro we have that fire because we're open to trying different things like what we role play we dominate each other we watch porn together we uh try all sorts of different things we watch porn together how does that add fire to your relationship like, i don't mind him watching sexy women on tv watching him gets turned on gets me turned on then we try to do all the positions they did in the porno. That's hot. And I don't know. I don't know how I feel about like James watching another woman though, you know, getting turned on by another girl. But you better get over that shit. He's looking and probably lusting. I ain't leaving no man. Married or not. Sometimes you gotta let him eat out so he can remember how good home cooking really is. Eat out? Yeah. Like, like have sex with another woman? <laughs> yep. Do you let Will eat out sometimes? Sometimes. We eat out together. What? Girl, you're too much. <clears throat> <laughs> how does that work? We swing. Swing. I didn't know black people did freaky shit like that. Girl, black people do way more freakier shit than they portray. Don't frown on it. You might actually like it. It's fun. I don't know, Keish. I got kind of turned on the other night watching you and Will in the back seat. But to watch my man with another woman? No, I don't, I don't think I could do that. You trying to tell me if you have a fine, sexy man to yourself for one night, you can't let him do his thing. Uh, everybody ain't gotta be in the same room. It's more fun that way, but it don't have to be that way. I don't know, maybe if, if, I, if I had my own, maybe, but James most definitely ain't going for that. Girl, you don't know what he would do, unless you put him in that situation. You feel me? We're almost to the house, so I don't want to go in there smelling like weed. Right. My eyes are on. Let me see. That's some good shit, wasn't it? Yeah. <clears throat> hey, baby. Hey. How you doing? Doing? Um, not much. Just catching up on some news. Where you been? Shopping with Keisha. Oh, you two been spending a lot of time lately. Mm -hmm. She got a man or something? I don't know if you would call him her man, but she got somebody she deal with. Why? I don't know. I would like you to invite him over. I'd like to get to know the person that you been so fond of lately. Okay. That'll be fun. All right. I'll set it up. All right. What's that smell? So Will, what you do for a living? I own a gentleman's club called Erotic City. Strip joint? Yeah, I'm what you would call something like a pimp. Not full-fledged pimping, <laughs> just something like it. Well. Nah, for real? Nah, I'm just messing with you, brother. It's a business, just like any other business. I run a few of them. Oh, okay. Well, to each his own. I'm pretty sure it's never a dull moment down at your joint. Well, actually, when you actually run the business and it's a job, it's not like when you come down there and unwind. But if you ever got some free time, you can get in VIP for free. I got you. Man, I ain't been down to the strip club. I don't know how long, you know, with the wife, Baby, business, 
I'll never have enough time to do anything like that, you know? You should, you should make more time. Don't let life consume your life. Yeah, we should go out together more, baby. Have some adventures. Yeah, be adventurous. Wait, 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 wait. I'm oh, a boss. Will should understand that. He's a businessman. That's 24 seven. Look, I'm a businessman, but the business I'm in, I always gotta make sure my woman is pleasured. So Keisha, how you feel about Will's business? No worries. When you walk into a club and 99% of the women in there are naked, you'd be surprised at how much attention the woman with clothes on actually receives. Wait, 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 wait. So you mean you actually hang out up there? Yep. Damn, Will, you the man. Tasha would never hang out at a strip bar, would you, baby? Huh? Uh, excuse me. Where's the bathroom? Down the hall. I'll be right back. Third door on the left. I use this opportunity to get another bottle of wine. This is fun. Yeah, I'm having a good time. Oh, I forgot, we don't have any soap in that bathroom. Let me go in the kitchen and get it so we can give it to him. Girl, sit down, you've done enough. I'll go get it and take it to him. Okay. Thanks, girl. Mm -hmm. James, hmm? can you pass me the hand soap, please? Sure, no problem. Thanks. I got it. It's a nice size, too. What? This bottle of hand soap is a nice size. Oh, yeah. Uh, I get them from Sam's Club. Thank you. I was looking for that. I'm looking for something, too. <laughs> I'm coming in. You having fun, babe? Yeah. You sure are taking a long time with that soap. Yeah. Hey, remember, I got that spot in VIP for you, man. Whenever you're ready. Okay. All right. All right? Yes, sir. All right. You ready, baby? Yep. Let's go. Get out of here. All right, you guys, shoot us a text and you go so we know you got there safe, okay? You got it, babe. Talk to you later. Son. See you later, love. Bye. Y'all drive safe. Mmm. So glad to go. Mmm. Mmm. Yeah? Yeah. What a night. Yeah, it was nice. Wish I could have been over more often. I wasn't talking about dinner. Oh, yeah. That was nice, too. It was spontaneous, aggressive. It's like he was getting some new booty or something. He was doing it to me like, like I was somebody else. No, I was thinking about my beautiful wife the whole time. Well, if you ever need some new booty, Talk to me, you know. I'm pretty sure the day I ask for some new booty, that'll be the day you'll be packing up all my shit. If you want to know, you ask. More cereal? <laughs> you told that nigga what? <laughs> I told him, have you ever felt like you needed some new booty? Just let me know. What did he say? <laughs> Nothing. He just sat there and gave me this goofy look like he couldn't believe what he was hearing. Wow, he was stumped. I see you letting that inner freak out a little bit, huh? Maybe. I might be rubbing off on you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna be honest with you, Keish. The only two times he's made love to me like he really wanted to in months was when he was around you. Wait, what? Yeah, I'm serious. I mean... <laughs> 
you're pretty, confident, sexy. And I think you kind of turned James on a little bit. Wait. He was an animal, girl, the two times we made love around you. Wait, are you saying that he wants to cheat on you with me? I mean, is that what you're saying? No, that's not what I'm saying. I don't think you even have time to cheat on anybody. With anybody. But... I just... I just noticed a difference, you know? And... If he's gonna keep giving it to me like that, you can move into the guest room. <laughs> That's all I'm saying, shit. <laughs> Girl, you're <it's> stupid. <laughs> <laughs> no, but seriously though, he needs to be giving it to you like that all the time. I, know. I told you, them married eyes, they be wondering. I know. I know he does, but I just don't know what to do to get a reaction like that out of him anymore, you know? You got to change it up on them every now and then. Look, I got some porno DVDs in the truck. I'll give you a couple of them. You and James, you watch it, try a couple of scenes without climaxing. Me and Will, we get through about four before we can't take it any longer. Four scenes? That's like an hour. <laughs> we haven't done it like that since before the baby. Damn. Yeah, girl, we'll be putting in that work. I guess. Shit. Wait, wait, what are you doing riding around with porn in your trunk? Girl, it keeps me some freaky shit on deck, okay? <laughs> While I'm driving around, I'm watching on this dash, stuck in traffic, okay? In the drive through at McDonald's, in a funeral procession, oh my God. whenever, okay? Woo, woo. <laughs> right on deck. <laughs> Like an hour ago. He's doing pretty good. Okay. Yeah. Is his nightlight on? Yeah, of course. All right. Yeah. Uh, yeah. What's this we watching? Oh, this is porn. Porn? Who's porn is this? Wesley Pipes, Greatest Hits. Okay. Uh, let me fast forward it to the good stuff. Suck this motherfucking dick. Mm -hmm. You know I like my shit wet up like a drive-by. Mm -hmm. Do a drive-by on this dick. <laughs> <laughs> Did he just uh, say do a drive-by on this dick? Uh, oh, this pussy man. is tender than a oh. motherfucker. Like oh. a Popeye's three-piece. Oh. <laughs> Baby, I gotta get a snack. Oh, really man. Good. Bring me something up, too, baby. Uh. Mm -hmm. uh. He was wild, wasn't he? <laughs> I told him. I told him not to do it. Oh, that. my God. <laughs> mm. How was movie night last night? It was fun. No sex, no. but... Hey, I did learn what a dick dog was. Wait, what the... <laughs> What's a dick dog? Dick dog. You know when a dude pulls his balls up to his dick, makes it look like his dick is in a bun? Oh my god. Dick dog. I definitely shouldn't have given you that Wesley Pipes DVD. It was a bad that idea. That dude was more entertaining than Kevin Hart, okay? He should have his own stand-up. I'm gonna guess that watching porno is, is not James's thing. Maybe he's into watching the ladies live, like at a strip bar. Yeah, but you heard what he said the other night. He's like, He's not really into the strip club, you know? You just gotta bring the strippers to him. I don't follow. Okay, listen. There's this girl, her name's Candy. She works at the bar. She does house calls. And when I tell you she's dynamic. <laughs> Hello. Yeah, Linda. Okay, why you just can't sign for it? All right, send her up. All right. How you doing, where do I sign? Mr. Birch, I think you're going to need to sit down for this one. Sit down? Mm -hmm. 
What are you doing? Mr. Birch, I think you're going to need to sit down. Who put you up to this? <laughs> yeah, girl, I sent that stripper over there. Now I'm about to dance for him. Girl, me and Will do that all the time. Matter of fact, we're about to go do it right now. Okay. All right, I'll let you later, okay? Hi, babe. Hey. How was work? Different. I can say that much. How so? Well, apparently somebody thought it was a good idea to send me a strippergram. A strippergram? Yeah. Do you know who sent it? I don't know. Maybe one of the suppliers. I'm not even, I don't have any idea. Yeah, yeah. Was she pretty? Yeah, she was pretty. So you enjoyed it? Actually, yes. I mean, she took me from handling some of my business, but uh, I can say it was pretty entertaining, say the least. What you doing? Why you been acting so strange lately? I'm not. I just want to do it like we did when Keisha was around. I want to fuck like that twice a week. Keisha around? What are you talking about? It is what it is. Maybe you're attracted to Keisha and you think you can't have her. So you think about her when you fuck me. Baby, let me no, explain. we've been together a long time. Been doing it the same way, in the same bed, at the same time of night. I need a switch. Are you telling me that your wife said it's cool for you to get some new ass? Then she brought a porno home for y'all to watch in bed? Then she hired a stripper just because? She ain't hired a stripper just because. She said she did it to spice up our sex life. Man, your wife hired strippers to spice up y'all sex life. Nigga, did she got a sister? Come on, Rob. I'm serious, man. I'm confused. Okay, James. I'm serious, too, with this quote-unquote problem you have in this shit. Man, don't take this the wrong way, man. It seems like your wife got a little freak in her daughter that you don't even know about, bro. Yeah, that's the thing. Ever since this old college friend came around, she been acting totally different. At least sexually. I mean, you know, old friends bring old ways. Maybe you need to look into old girl. You know what I'm saying? Talk to her alone and see what's that about. That's the other problem. It seems like every time I'm around her, even if it's for a second, she hitting on me. 
She grabbed my Johnson and everything. Damn, she grabbed your dick? In my kitchen with my wife in the next room. Man, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing out here, man. But James, you ain't got the problem, dog. I got the fucking problems for real. <laughs> no. Nah. With my wife acting like a nympho, this business, and her friend hitting on me, I got problems. I mean, it seems to me, dog, like maybe the new friend the problem. You need to take a look into that. That's what I'm thinking. Yeah, you might be right. I watched this shot. Actually, I was hoping to catch you. I want to talk to you for a second. Talk to me? About what? Well, first, my wife. I mean, I don't know what's gotten into her lately. And ever since you've been around, she's been acting totally different. And second, I want to know why you've been hitting on me, your quote-unquote girl's husband. Well, the answer to your first question is, your wife is sexually deprived. And from what she tells me, you haven't given her what she needs lately. She understands that you're tied up with the business a lot, but um, what you need to try to do is tie her up some time and give it to her like a real man. I what? mean, every now and then. My wife told you that? I mean, not in so many words, but you get the picture. She's been so tired lately. I mean, the business. It's doing well, but, you know, at the same time, that need all my attention. I want my son to have something. I don't want my son to be, you know, asking a white man for any job or anything like that. I mean, it's hard work. Tasha should know that. She understands that. But what you need to understand is that she has a wild side to her. You can only keep a tiger caged for so long, but when they come out, the world better watch out. So, what you helping her and her tiger get out of her cage, or what's going on? No, I'm just here to return a favor to her. What you mean? That's between me and Tasha. And the answer to your second question is, I just want to fuck you. That's all. Well, I'm faithful to my wife. And that's not going to happen. And I would appreciate Listen, it. Listen, before you answer, I just want you to think about <sighs> this smell and get back to me later. Baby, why you ain't come talk to me about our problems? James. I tried plenty of times to talk to you about it. You either didn't have time or you apparently weren't listening. I've been so busy at the business. It's been a lot going on. I understand. But now, I need you to understand. I have needs and I need you to satisfy them. I need you to want me, lust for me. Okay, baby. I'm going to make more time for us and more time for love making. Well, thank you, baby. But I don't want to make love anymore. I want to fuck. I want to fuck like we're teenagers. I want to fuck like we're having one night stands with each other. I want you to fuck me like you were fucking Keisha. Baby, I told you. No! It's okay, I understand. She's attractive. She's outgoing. She's sexy. She's been like that the whole time I've known her. So I understand if she does something to you. But that's what I want for us. I want to do it like we did it those two nights. Baby. Your friend Keisha, 
She been hitting on me. And that's just how she is. She told me she would do you. Would you do her? Baby, I would never cheat on you. Never. It's not cheating if I want you to do it. So, what you supposed to get out of me sleeping with Keisha? You gonna sleep with her friend Will? That's not gonna happen. <sighs> Even though they swing, I'm not trying to sleep with another man. I just want to open up some doors for us, sexually. I think it would turn me on to watch you with another woman. thought about our conversation last night. I'm willing to try this if you want us to. Are you sure you want to do this? I'm sure. I'm sure. Okay. Well, let's discuss exactly how we going to do it and who we going to do it with. Okay, well, I told you last night, you and another woman, I watch. What did you have in mind? Uh, I didn't put too much thought into it. I just know you're not having sex with another man. And... Let's not involve Keisha. I mean, you two are friends and I don't want this to mess up your friendship. Okay. I want to pick the girl then. Okay. Well, how we go about doing this? Keisha told me about some Facebook groups for swingers. I'll join a few and see what I can come up with. Okay. She better not be crazy. <laughs> She's got to be pretty. Okay. And sexy. Yeah, like foreign or exotic looking. All right, whatever you come up with, I'm going to do it. Yeah? I'm with it. I'm getting excited just thinking about it. I am too. Let's go upstairs. See, it's working out for us already. Pretty. 
And you're way more handsome than your wife described. Take that shirt off. Look at those muscles. You want to take this dress off? Yeah, could you? Excuse me, I'm gonna go freshen up a little bit. Did you see her ass? Oh my God, it was perfect. Perfect. Are you sure you want to do this? Yeah, it's exciting. Now let me see you beat that pussy up. I'll be wow. right over here, watch. So what's up, Tasha? I haven't talked to you in a minute. What's going on with you? Nothing, girl. Just spending more time with my man, that's all. <laughs> James finally got his shit together, huh? You look happier. I am happy. You look really happy. Yeah, he's been opening up to new things. New things like what? Like Amani, Fancy, <laughs> Tiffany. <laughs> you know, new things. You little freak. <laughs> so you and James been swinging, huh? Not swinging per se, but like, he does his thing and I watch. I like observing. Watch? Ob observing? Girl, you better get in where you fit in. You can't let him have all the fun. That night with you and Will. Remember? I learned something about myself watching you guys in the backseat. I'm into voyeurism. I don't care if it's voyeurism, tourism, dwarfism, or any other kind of ism. You should be out there tasting different flavors of men too. That's not why we were doing this, Quiche. We just, we needed to spice up our relationship and it's been working. Of course it's working. Because he gets to half his cake and eat it too. Fuck that. Tasha, that's bullshit. Keish, James already said he's not into me sleeping with other men, and so I don't think that's gonna work out. Not into you sleeping with another man. Girl, you like the taste of different things too. Just like that night after the party at school. Girl, them big niggas looking at me like I'm a piece of meat. Them two fat motherfuckers, they gonna go pro. They like top picks. Mm, you better holler at them, girl. So I don't care about that stuff. I'm having my own stuff. Listen, they said if you get down with them, they might sign a letter of intent to come play at the school. Them? Down with them? Oh no, hell no. I'm not that drunk. If they come here, they can make the whole school better. Increase Justin's yardage. Look, we about to get that NFL money. NFL money? I don't care about NFL money. Tasha. I mean, it's gonna help you and Justin, then. I don't know, I guess, I guess it's always kind of been a fantasy of mine. <laughs> them two niggas gonna follow you around campus for the next two years, sniffing them panties. You sure it'll help you and Justin? I'm positive. What? Hey, babe. Hey, babe. I was thinking about something. Okay, what's up? So, we did the thing with the three girls, right? Right. You had fun, right? Um, yeah, I did. But it was only because it was something we did together. But if it's a problem, we could stop. No, I don't want you to stop. Okay. I get really wet watching you. I just... I want to know what you think about taking things to another level. Another level like what? Like some girl on girl action? <laughs> no. Like, if we got a room with another couple and we had sex and they had sex, how would you feel about that? I don't think I would like that at all. I mean, that mean the guy would see you and I don't think I can handle that. Babe, all the rules would be discussed beforehand. <laughs> Listen, 
Mm -hmm. I can find the right couple if you're willing to take the next step. If we take this next step, at the end of this journey, will we be walking together? Of course. start. You up here asshole naked. This man looking at you. I want to beat this motherfucking ass. And then why the fuck was you looking at him so hard? I'm sorry. I won't ask you to do something like that again. No, you won't because this shit is over with. We ain't doing this shit no more. Come on, let's go. Fine. Whatever you want. Think you lonely now, wait until the night You know your man gotta stand that's why I'm out of sight You know the group of chicks come with the entourage I'm handling business, baby, nonchalant You got some girls, be telling you nonsense The nosy ass bro, just fascinated With what you doing, and how you living Misery, luck, company, don't fall for it You lucky to wanna hate you, what you got you already talked about you ain't have many friends as women yeah. Emotional ladies, all the drama they selling yeah. And the ones that be telling be the ones that want to be with your fella So if you think you lonely now, nah, wait until the night You know your man got standards, why I'm out of sight You know the group of chicks come with the entourage I'm handling business, baby, nonchalant You got some girls be telling you nonsense Company don't fall for it Reluctant to want to hate on what you got Hey, bro Hey, honey Dinner's almost ready. What time are you coming home? Yeah, I'm swamped here at the office. I made lasagna. Yeah, just put my plate in the oven. Where's Junior? I already dropped him off at my mom's. Are you really not coming home right now? No, I'm positive. <sighs> We've been distant lately. I'm just trying to spend some quality time with you. Fine. Text me when you're on the way. Keish, where are you at? I'm coming over. Thanks for letting me come over and kick it with you guys. I didn't want to be alone again tonight. It's no biggie. You can come chill with me and Will whenever you want. Thanks, girl. Mm -hmm. you want some of this? Yeah. Let me taste it, babe. Really? Hey, girl. <laughs> I'm to kiss. Try to drink the whole bottle. Mm -hmm. Wow, that's what is this? Hold on. She drank it. Right. Shit. That's good. I like it. It's that rim.
Oh my god, I gotta go. I gotta go. Mm. Expecting your wife? Yeah, what's going on here? Where's Tasha? Relax, Tasha's not here. Just take off your coat, pour yourself a drink. I mean, unless you want me to. No, 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 no. Right. Stay right there. I'm about to leave. I ain't got time for these games. Wait, 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 wait. Wouldn't you like to know how your wife's panties wound up in that little gift box I sent you? How did you end up with my wife's panties? Well, um, pour yourself a drink. I'll tell you all about it. No, I already got a drink. How did you end up with my wife's panties? Well, um, Tasha came to visit me the other night, complaining to me about how you were falling back to your old ways. Okay, so what that got to do with you having her panties? She needed someone to vent to. So we had some drinks, smoked some good trees. <laughs> trees? Tasha don't smoke weed. Huh? Apparently there's a lot you don't know about Tasha. How the fuck did you end up with my wife's panties? Well, uh, let me tell you. <sighs> Had to work late again tonight? Yeah. Shipment came in right before closing. Yeah. But I know it hasn't been exciting lately. Uh, but I do want to get it back to the way we were before, you know, the hotel fiasco. Won't you invite Keisha and Will over? Let's have a date night. Yeah, maybe I'll set it up for next weekend. Mm, no, not next weekend. Let's do it this weekend. Friday. Friday? Friday. Okay, that sounds good. Okay. Well, I get the wine. Let's let's do it. Okay, that sounds good. Tasha? Yeah, it was, girl. Thank you. No problem. I love to entertain. Hmm. Hey. <laughs> Anybody want to hit this? Fuck yeah. Light that shit up. No, I'm fine. Y'all go ahead and enjoy yourself. I'm going to get something we can use as an ashtray. <laughs> so, 
So, Will, I had a chance to come visit your bar. Pretty nice place. Good looking, man. Too bad I missed you. No problem. I bumped into Keisha. She showed me around. That's my girl. She take real good care of me. I know she took care of you. Yeah, she's a pretty good hostess. And you take real good care of me. Ooh, this is my kind of party. That's how you like the party? Yeah, it is. You wanna hit this? Yeah. No, I'm fine. Tasha, you about to hit that? my feet all day. Why don't you ask James? Tasha, you mind? Nah, girl, go ahead. Come on, James. Hey, girl, oh. I to my Look, baby, I... Tasha. I love you. I want a divorce. They're gonna be right here. We ain't gonna let nothing happen to you, okay? I guess the black one is fuckable. <laughs> Do that shit. Justin, come here. It's on. Let me talk to you. Bro, I'm hitting this pussy first.
take this next step. At the end of this journey, we will be walking together. Of course. You said at the end of this journey, we'll be walking together.